Raymart here, and welcome to COVID Chronicles episode 2. I'm filming today on the best day of the year. It's actually Star Wars Day, so, um, you know, everything's going well at the moment. So, but I'd just like to thank everyone that has had um, the time, or has taken the time to watch the first episode of Raymart's COVID Chronicles. Um, I really appreciate the views and the very kind comments that I've been receiving on um, Twitter and Facebook and other um, social media platforms. So I really appreciate, um, especially the time you've taken to do that and to watch the video. So thank you. But um, yeah, it's honestly been a very crazy couple of weeks. Um, today I'm in a very, very kind of energetic mood because it is Star Wars Day and spent the day um, uh, watching some Star Wars um, that's come out today and um, it's been really good and obviously, you know, celebrating it in my own way, um, posting a selfie on Instagram is how I celebrate it every year, but, um, but it's actually really been a good um, present, I guess, in, in the sense, because in the last two weeks has just been super hectic. I've just had, I think I counted about seven um, pieces of assessment, which, which does range from, you know, your 40%, uh, 30% essays or reports um, or role plays um, that I've had for some of my um, language courses. And so, all of this stuff just came at once and prior to that I was just still catching up with the semester in terms of the move to the online environment which for me I mean it's a great thing that we have available to us but it's just been very very difficult to focus especially you know on online lectures and um, classes I'm not as like vocal in those and I think it's because I just lose focus really easily when I just am watching a video, basically. Um, well, a video with, um, and for like two and a half hours or two hours or whatever. So um, that's been difficult. So I've had to use a lot of my own time to kind of catch up on things. So, um, and usually when things would get crazy, I would kind of um, work less I, or at least say that maybe I have a few less um, hours in a particular week, but I'm at this stage of thinking at the moment where, you know, if I do say that, um, it, it'll probably come back to bite me later on, um, because, I, again, like I said in my last episode, I'm very lucky to have, um, three jobs. One of them, um, I do expect to, um, to, to finish at the end of June because the project ends, but for the other two, it's just that uncertainty of, you know, will that funding be cut later down the track? Maybe, maybe not, but I just don't want to risk it because, um, you know, as a student you have to pay things like rent, um, electricity, internet, and actually all of those things came through recently. So, um, for me, I'm just grateful that I've kind of kept to that because having that money to, to, um, to pay those bills has just been such a mind reliever and just so grateful that I've just got all the basics covered, um, which I guess a lot of people is not able to say that, but... Um, you know, I'm just glad that, you know, with all that happening, I've been able to, um, to help other students where, um, peer, my other peers, wherever I can, um, at USC. Um, so yeah, and I just finished my last assignment on the weekend, and so, and no, I think it was yesterday, actually, and, um, today's been Star Wars Day, and, um, in Queensland, it's been a public holiday, so I just had the day to just chill, and I feel so good, and I feel energetic. Um, unlike the, the weekend, if I did a vlog on the weekend, I'd just be like this. It would not be very interesting. Um, but yeah, so I'm very interested in connecting with you, with you all. Um, so please continue to, to, to share it on Twitter, to share it on whatever platform you use. I've been sharing it on Instagram. Um, my hashtag is, well, my handle is at Raymart Walker. So if you want to find me on there, please, please follow me. Um, and yeah, if you have any comments, questions, or whatever, or if there's anything that might be relevant to you, please, please let me know. Anyway, until next time, until episode three of the COVID Chronicles.